Hey guys, welcome back to Jack Me Nimble Candle Creations. I am just hopefully and this is going to be a short video. Um, and I wanted to show you some of the new soaps that I have made recently. So this first one here is a soap and it's called Sleigh Ride and that's just a little label on top. It's already wrapped and everything ready for my other craft show that's coming up this next weekend. Um, and this is the back and this is, so this is the label and the ingredients and everything but anyway um, it's really it's really nice. It's just a clear soap with embeds and it has little has glitter in it and all different stuff different colors and I just think it would be a really awesome um, hand soap or I hope people use it too um, I guess in their shower. The next one is another soap I did and it's called Jack Frost and it there's the little label for it it's real cute and each one is has a different snowflake on it so I have that one and then I have this one and I can put these in here and then I have this one so all the embeds they have glitter in the front and then it's a clear base and oh, that label's coming out. Anyway, it's a clear base and um, and it's got glitter throughout. So anyway, this is a glycerin soap, not a goat's milk soap, like a vanilla peppermint scent. So yeah, I really like it. I think it's just a really cool design. So hopefully I will, these will be popular. I only made three um, for my shows, so we shall see. one is called Oak Moss and Sage, and it has a um, pine cone on the front, and it's a earthy scent. There's no label. And this is a goat's milk soap. And um, it's, it's an earthy oak moss, if you know what oak moss is, and then it, you do smell the sage, so it's really nice. And it is naturally colored with um, parsley powder, and I have a little bit of olive leaf powder in there. Olive leaf powder is a nice skin, add, a nice soap additive for the skin. Um, good in the soap and it kind of helps to helps with the lather and stuff like that so anyway here's um my lavender soap and on the back is the label and this is a goat's milk soap and i have different ones i tried to do a swirl but i poured it a little too hot or like a marbled look and so it just didn't come out um, as great as I wanted to, but I really like the little leaf embed on top. Um, it's my same lavender that I've always made. This is just going to be, I think, the new design for it. So I hope you guys like it. And this is my oatmeal milk and honey soap. And here's the front with a little bee. And then here's my label. This is a goat's milk soap. And it's just my same oatmeal, milk, and honey um, soap and recipe, and same fragrance oil that I've used before. Um, I just added this little bee to the top. Um, I think it's really neat looking. And I have several of these that I'm going to sell, um, and I hope they do well, and I hope that people like them. So, Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed um, seeing some of the new soaps that I've been working on and some of the new designs. And wish me luck this weekend at my craft show. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.